I am incredibly lucky to have found this thing that I just love to do and that I seem to have a knack for and that doesn't feel like work. There's one other figure that is, has been really prominent in my uh, triathlon journey as, as far as a mentor and a role model, and that would be Terry Laughlin. I start a workout uh, at, the, at the pool that I swim at in, in New York. Uh, I, I lose sense of time completely. Right this hour, right this minute, I'm gonna have an amazingly great time by, in swimming uh, by understanding it better. Uh, by connecting with it mentally, emotionally, spiritually, by putting my whole self into it. I get into the water and enjoy every stroke, and I think about every stroke. Uh, that's something that Terry has taught me. And you see it right from his initial interaction with people that he's not saying, here's my resume and I need to work with the best athletes. He's saying, Here's my knowledge base, and I want to share it with everyone, regardless. And I get as much enjoyment seeing a person learn to swim or complete 25 yards as I do someone breaking a record in Division I at West Point or someone uh, completing their first triathlon. And it's a genuine appreciation for all of it that you just see. And Dick would come in, and he would sit on the bench and watch me swim for an hour and a half. And it, it's, I still get emotional thinking about Dick being willing to do that for me, even though I wasn't a very good swimmer. If you want to swim, you want to swim efficiently, you want to swim with pleasure, you want to find swimming as a way of being able to calm yourself in a, in a world that's anything but calm, uh, well worth every dime, every dollar that you'd be able to spend.